Hello, I'm Tom Borlet from CBD Sloth and today I want to talk about how hemp can help bees. Our fuzzy little buzzing friends of the garden are sadly decreasing at an alarming rate. In the USA alone, the population has dropped from 6 million in 1947 to 2.4 million in 2008. Even more alarmingly, it's dropped by 45% between year 2020 and 2021. In the UK, the numbers have been decreasing since 1980, but it started to level out a little bit. With a decreasing population of bees, this brings on a massive number of issues. So why is the bee population decreasing? With an ever-growing population, we're constantly expanding into wild areas to build houses and commercial buildings, meaning there's consistently smaller area for the bees to live in. However, it's not just the loss of habitat which is affecting the population. The pollution they breathe in is known to have a profound effect on their life expectancy. The addition of pesticides and insecticides in crops is known to be responsible for a huge amount of bee deaths. Other factors are also playing a role, such as droughts and diseases. So why are bees so important? If we were to lose bees, it wouldn't just be sad from an ethical point of view. It would also cause devastating effects to our ecological balance of nature. Bees are pollinators, meaning they remove pollen from flowers, so flowering plants can reproduce. Approximately a third of the food eaten by humans is pollinated by bees. That includes 100% of almonds. The plants that are pollinated by bees also help to feed plenty of animals and birds, meaning a loss of bees could have a huge effect on a number of animals as they lose their food supply. On top of all that, honey tastes amazing and has a huge number of health benefits, thanks to the healthy bacteria contained within. So how can hemp help bees? With a decreasing bee population, we can't allow levels to continue to drop. It's our responsibility to halt the decline and reverse the trend that we have set. Fortunately, many people believe that hemp could be a potential solution to help drive up the bee population. Hemp can help to support a diverse array of bees, working as a floral resource with early studies showing that there's the potential to enhance pollinator populations. During the cropping season, industrial hemp could play a pivotal role in providing necessary nutrition for bees. The bees will visit male hemp flowers for their pollen, which is packed to the brim with fats and proteins. Also, in the latter part of the summer, floral resources can be lower, meaning there are less options for bees in certain areas, whereas hemp can still provide a nutrition source for them. Another factor which is key to highlight is that hemp doesn't really require insecticides. While industrial hemp for CBD oil must be grown organically, meaning no pesticides are used. Hemp is highly porous, while the pesticides will travel through to the CBD extract, which is why it's crucial that hemp is grown organically. Interestingly, one study found that bees tend to like taller plants, but it found that the tall hemp plant provided the perfect environmental setting for them, with 17 times the quantity of bees visiting hemp plants over the smaller plants. Normally, plants are colourful and have strong aromas to entice bees to come along, helping their pollen to spread to female plants. But hemp doesn't require this. It's not as colourful and doesn't have those strong enticing aromas, but what it does have is a huge quantity of pollen. So what can you do in the garden today? Well, hemp might not be the answer if you want to grow something in your garden, considering you need a set license to grow hemp. There are plenty of actions you can take to help the bee population. You should fill the garden with plants that are ideal for pollinators, such as borage or honeysuckle. You can also try to make sure bees have a good water resource by filling a little container with water and pebbles. You want to add pebbles, sticks and leaves so that the bees don't drown in there at all though. Also, I know it's in our instinct to pull up weeds, but these are actually quite useful for bees, so just leave them a little bit. Hope you all found that useful. Catch you later.